Hey everybody, this is a super quick little video just on my acoustic guitar settings. I've had a couple of people just ask if I'd share them and so that is exactly what I'm going to do right now for you. Here we go. Okay, so firstly my actual preamp itself. Uh, I am running a little bit more bass. You can see it's just above half there um, for the bass. I have a little bit less treble, it's pretty much flat, that is at 50% on the treble side of things. My guitar tends to be pretty bright, hence dropping the treble down and giving a bit more bass, and then volume wise, it's pretty much right up there, that's kind of like 85% I guess, volume, and I tend to do that so that there's just a good amount of signal going to the desk or the stage or uh, the sound guy rather than picking up noise just from the circuitry and, and hum of general electronic systems. So I could probably tone that down a bit and it would give me some room to move, but I don't change it much on my guitar anyway. I leave it pretty much set and then use boosts or, or pedals to change volume settings. Moving on now to the settings in my Voice Live 3. Going into the guitar menu, I'm not using the body res, I just have it on acoustic, um, pre-gain, post-gain, it's all at zero, and really I just take out a little bit more of the high in my guitar, this is all pretty flat, not a lot going on, a little bit more of that high gain taken out, that's really it. So the Voice Live 3 isn't doing a whole lot in terms of my settings, there's a reverb that I use for the acoustic side of things. I have that set at a high level, um, 0 dB, and I, and I take that down in the effects section when I use it, which is, um, for those of you that are familiar, if you just use that third pedal you'll get to effects, and if I'm using the effects from here, I'll turn this up maybe to minus nine or somewhere there. It means I've got room to move if I'm in a really, really dry room and I can turn it up further, but that seems to work pretty well for me. The last thing that I think is useful is when I'm playing acoustically, I use this hit pedal and it turns on a boost and a delay at once for my acoustic settings. So if we go back in here, you'll find that I've got a delay that the hit control is on and I also have a drive where the hit control is on so a little bit of gain um, still acoustic but I get a little bit of drive and boost from that 8 dB of, of pre-gain really so super quick video but those are my settings they're the basis of what I use Feel free to copy them, ignore them. I hope it's useful to you. And, uh, and again, do what's right for your guitar um, because our pickups and our tone and, and amps that we're running through are all gonna sound different. Your guitar might not have nearly the amount of treble that comes through on mine, so copying mine would be a bad suggestion in that case. But a couple of you asked for it, so I wanted to just share the settings and that's them. I hope they're useful.